dog can't become a god. <laughs> All I'm looking for is a way to become a god. I'm fucking over anybody that's getting involved. I'm a destructive mess and I really don't care at all. So so the first section, we're going to start off by plucking the open A. Then we're going to hammer on 5, 7, 8 of the A, D, and A string. Then we're going to hyper pick with our middle finger the open high E. Then we're going to come back down playing the 8th fret of A. Then we're going to come back up and hybrid pick the open B. Then we're going to come down 5, 7, 8 of G, D, and A respectively. So that first section slow should sound something like this. So for the second section, we're going to pluck the 11th of A and then the 12th of B. Then we're going to hammer on to the 13th of B and then slide up to 15. Then we're going to hybrid pick the open E again. This time I use my ring finger. Then you're going to come down and pluck the low E. And then you're going to play this chord which is 16, 17, and then 19 on the G, B, and E strings. I hit that with an upstroke, and then come back down to the low E. So that section should sound like this slow. This next section, we're going to start out by plucking the open A. We're going to hammer on 12, and then 15. Then we're going to tap um, 19 on the D. Then we're going to pull off the 12 on the D, pluck the low E, then we're going to come back to the 14th of D, slide down to the 9th of D, then we're going to tap 19 again on the D, and then when I release my finger here, I'm going to pull it off and strum this chord, which is 8 on the A and then 9 on the D. Then you're going to come down and play just a regular E power chord. So that whole section slow should sound like... And then one last bit is the run I do. So we're going to start with an open B, hammer on to the third fret, pull off, and then we're going to come down two on the G, uh, three on the D, and then five on the A. Then I'm going to hybrid pick the open B, and then I'm coming up here and hitting the harmonics on 12 of the G and 12 of B. So slow, that should sound like... So now for the final section, we're going to come up here and we're, we're going to bar across the 10th fret of uh, D, G, B, and E. And you're just going to strum it like that. Then you're going to strum it again and then hammer on to the 12th fret of E. And you're going to lift that off and I'm picking down that same shape. Then you're going to um, slide up from there with this chord. Um, so that is 14, 13, and 12 on the D, G, and B string. So I just start a whole step down and slide up. So then you go to open E. Then you're going to pluck 12 on both the B and E string. Then you're going to do the 7th fret of both a, uh, a and E down here. Then you're going to come up to 15, 14, 13 on uh, D, G, and B. Then you're going to slide down a half step. And then on that second hit, you're going to add a little vibrato. And then you're going to end it with this little arpeggio here which is 12, 13, 12, 13, 14, 15, 12, slide to the uh, 11, and then you're just going to hammer on to the 12th fret.
that whole last section slow should sound something like... Mm -hmm. 